show you my lovely crafters. It's Kim. So I got back the recipe card swap, and this month's theme was summer sides. Um, and we had a few people come in and participate because it's our first. We're only open, you know, like going on a month and a half. So we're doing really good. Um, so I just wanted to show you the amazing work that these wonderful women at the site have done. So I'll start this way and we'll work around. So this one here came from Latricia. And Latricia did eat, she said, it says veggies, salads, and sides. She put yellow trim on the outside here. And she did a nice broccoli salad. Looks good. Um, and she put, we're going to, I will definitely tell you my yum scale when I am done with Miss Latricia. And so she did it very simply, very nicely done finished card. Beautiful. This one here is from Miss Becky Boyer and Becky's at www.beckyboyer.com So that's Becky. She has that cute with these little tags. Aren't they adorable? So she did this and it says home cooking with a really cute um, apron on the front. She did the letters with these cute little writing on it and she put some washi tape on there and her card um, is on a bread and on the back of her card she did mama's macaroni salad woohoo it serves six to eight so I will definitely have to try this out and I will definitely let you know Becky how good it is and it was very nice because she added this to add notes like I guess we're going to write down here what we modified or what worked what didn't work everything else on here Awesome idea, actually, of this, Becky. I like this a lot, the uh, little notes section. So that was from Miss Becky. This is mine. Very boring, very plain. I know. I'm sorry. Please forgive me. I did just a simple card. I did, I wrote yummy down the side <laughs> with a little bit of lace. And I put a picture of the potato. I made potato salad. And I put a Krabby Patty because my four-year-old daughter is obsessed with, five-year-old daughter, God help me, is obsessed with Spongebob. And she loves Spongebob, so she wanted to put a sticker on there. So everybody got a sticker. Heather, you got more than one sticker, but <laughs> when you see her card, you'll know why. So I basically just matted it on here for the potato salad and, um, you know, made it very simple. But I hope you guys like the recipe. So the next one is from Miss Yvette. And she's Yvette Brink Brinkley at gmail.com. There she is there. So that's Yvette's. And Yvette did a lovely card. She put, she embossed the, uh, no, she didn't emboss. She stamped on these cute measuring spoons. I love that stamp. I've never seen that stamp before. It is so cute. She ran her paper through an embossing folder. And this says, Welcome to our home. This little stick stamp here. Very cute. I love your color choice also. Awesome work, guys. And she made creamy coleslaw. So now we have coleslaw, macaroni salad, potato salad, and a broccoli salad. So we have a nice creamy coleslaw here. Very lovely done. And last, but certainly not least, <laughs> is my Bambalicious Heather. She made... <laughs> the theme was summer sides. Now... I know that my lovely Bambi, she's a blonde, and it's nothing about the blonde hit people of America, please do not get offended, but my Bambi's a blonde. She made <laughs> a summer dessert, which could be eaten as a side, I'm not debating that issue. Everybody loves dessert on the side of their chicken, I love it. And she made, her thing here says, I believe that if life gives you lemons, you should make lemonade. And try to find somebody whose life has given them vodka and have a party. This is my kind of girl. We need to get a little toasted and have some of these wonderful lemon squares. <laughs> and the other funny part of her card is, her thing is, is that this recipe came from the June's Recipe of the Cookie of the Month book, 1963. Now, I know that I was not born in 1963, nor was my little blonde ambition, Heather. And, um, yes, we're children of the 80s. <laughs> and, um, 
And, um, yeah, I hope, we're, we're going to try this out. I'm actually going to try it out, and I'm going to let her know exactly how it tasted. So, and it's on a very slow oven, because the oven's going to cook at 275 for 10 minutes. I, I hope they'll be cooked, and we won't end up with salmonella poisoning. <laughs> well, my Bambalicious and my other lovelies, I appreciate your hard work and effort into making your cards. And I hope to see you guys really soon for the next swaps. Have a great day, guys.